Salut à tous, aujourd'hui nous ne sommes pas dans un café mais dans la chambre d'hôtel de Justin Ozuka pour son nouvel album You, I, Wind, Land and Sea. Bonjour. Bonjour, comment ça va <rire> Ça va, et toi Ça va bien. Alright, could you uh, say um, some words about your new album Many things have changed uh, between my first album and my second album. On the first album, I was just kind of starting, you know, on my own mm -hmm. with this project, with this idea that I was going to play songs and uh, perform songs that I wrote myself, you know, on the acoustic guitar. And, uh, and I guess I had this idea that I wanted a band, but it wasn't really clear to me until the album was finished and uh, slowly my band formed. Mm -hmm. Kind of... Uh, You know, one step at a time. First, I knew the drummer Alex, and then uh, we played with a bunch of different bass players, and we f we finally met Anthony, and then Anthony knew Mark, and so we formed together, and we've been touring for about three years together around mm -hmm. the world. You know, we've been touring a lot, and uh, I've been experiencing a lot of different things, but um, <clears throat> it was uh, it's all been really uh, a growing experience. And life has changed a lot, you know, my perspective on life has changed a lot over the years as well. You know, what I want to do with music and uh, this whole uh, opportunity. Your first single is My Heart Is Yours. Mm -hmm. uh, so good news for the fans. It's, uh, you keep writing romantic songs about mm -hmm. love. Yeah. The video clip has been filmed in Venice Beach. In Los Angeles. Yeah. Do you like this uh, this place full of this different location. cultures? Yeah. It was cool. Yeah, it was good. It was nice. You know, um, beautiful weather. It's nice to be by the ocean always. You know, and um, it was a positive experience. Yeah, it was nice. The most exciting part about being on the road is traveling, being in different places all the time. And uh, the whole experience, you know, meeting people, it can be, it, it just depends on my perspective, you know, it can be really dark and really annoying and, uh, you know, a bitter experience doing interviews and, um, you know, being around so many people and sometimes I get into a, you know, a gloomy space. And then on the contrary, it can be really um, positive and joyful and um, such an experience, you know. But it's, it is very overwhelming, you know. When I go back home and I'm in one place for two days, I can feel, you know, the things that have, have happened in my mind and the things that have happened to my body um, that I don't necessarily know what's happening in the moment, you know. But when I go back home, I realize a lot of things have happened. Um, so you're fond of heart in general, um, uh, music, of mm -hmm. course. Mm -hmm. Is there a single in particular you would like to sing with? Anywhere in the world? Yeah, anywhere in the world you choose. Um, anybody to sing with? Yeah, I was saying that I really like Sade. I love mm -hmm. her voice, I love Sade's voice. And uh, I love um, Mindy Smith. I really mm -hmm. love her voice. Indy Ari's voice is beautiful too. Um, I really like... Uh, Damien Marley and uh, Stevie Wonder. Hmm. Mm -hmm. What are your hobbies when you're not playing music? My hobbies? Uh, I like, I love hockey, I love ice hockey. Um, I love biking as well. And I love, um, I started skateboarding a little bit um, and I enjoy that. And um, I really have been um, taking an interest to uh, guitar. I want to get a new electric guitar. Oh, nice. And I want to start playing and uh, really just playing guitar more. Maybe in the new album there, there will be a... more electric guitar. Yeah. And, yeah, I'm sure things will change a lot in the time. So you, your father is Japanese, so does your vision have any relation uh, with Japanese culture? My father is, and my mother as well, they met through um, uh, Nichiren Buddhism. 
mm-hmm. and uh, they. Uh, so I grew up with a lot of those philosophies uh, in the household, and uh, okay. and so uh, yeah, I'm sure it's affected me in many ways from my perspective, you know. But sometimes you say when you go and you meet someone, yeah. you say Yoroshiko nagaishimas. It's kind of like a business sense, like nice to meet you, nice doing business with you. Okay. Or um, you say Otsukareta if I'm tired. Mm-hmm. Otsukare sama this. Um, you say uh, Konnichiwa. Say hi. Konnichiwa. Yeah. yeah. And uh, there's many things you can say. You know, it's you nice. Say you, you, are you learning the language? Slowly, yeah, slowly. Like French. Like French. It's nice. It's not mm. too difficult for you? No, I don't think so. You look like you're always cool and relaxed. And so what is your secret? Is it yoga or tai chi? Yoga or tai chi. <laughs> Actually, yeah. Yeah. yoga is... Uh, it's something that I want to get into. Tai Chi is something I want to get into as well because mm-hmm. I know those things. Uh, I've had experience with yoga and I, I was, um, it helped me a lot for sure. It mm-hmm. helped me get into my body and uh, doing interviews all the time is a really yeah. interesting thing and it's, uh, it's, it messes with me a lot. Yeah, you know? is, it, is it a sport? It's, the interview is a sport? Yeah. It's not a sport. No. <laughs> it's not a sport at all. I mean, is it a sport for the mind? Or, uh, it's kind of, uh, I guess it's just a challenge, you know, because mm-hmm. there's so many mental things that I go through when I'm doing an interview. For mm-hmm. instance, there's a camera, there's three cameras here, for instance, right? And I'm thinking, <laughs> uh, and there's other people here as well, you know, and I'm talking to you. And, uh, you know, I can't help but think about all the people that are listening, and I can't help but think about, um, yeah, all of that is just strange. So it's it's funny, you know, it's weird for me to, to, to be to just chill, you know? Mm. Yeah. How do you feel when you hear Justin from girls yelling your name with passion and devotion? Yeah, I would say, like, even right now, I can't help but tell you that um, it's uncomfortable, you know. Mm-hmm. Even right now, in this very moment, as cool as I may seem, and as you know, calm as I may seem, the experience is still really uncomfortable because I don't know really how to take it. I don't know how to react to it at times, you know. But I, I feel affected by it. I can't help but feel affected by it you know, uh, mentally and uh, emotionally. The whole thing it's a weird experience mm. but I'm um, trying to deal with it yeah it, it, it's, a, it's a weird thing it's really weird it's uncomfortable at times are you working on your third album and mm. uh, when and where is your next concert in Paris okay I am working on my next album mm-hmm. always thinking about it at this point and uh, trying to find songs for it and uh, there are songs that I've been working on that um, I'm writing now that, um, you know, I'm, I'm just basically trying to f- find the feel of the next album, I guess. And uh, in Paris, I don't know when we're going to play in Paris next. Exactly. Mm-hmm. I know we're going to be back in August or August. July or June, okay. June, July or August. During summer? Cool. During the summertime. <laughs> yeah. Is it London or Paris? London or Paris? Uh, well, I've been to Paris so many times. I would say Paris, of course. I'm in Paris now. Uh, surf or skate? Surfing. Yeah, you like it. Skateboarding or skating? Oh, skateboarding, yeah. Skateboarding, surfing, surfing or skateboarding. Yeah. Although I haven't been, I went surfing one time and I really enjoyed it. Mm. But I would prefer to be on, on a surfboard in, in the ocean. Uh, sunrise or sunset? Uh, sunset. But sunrise is great too. Yeah. They're both beautiful. Um, city or country? They're both different, you know, it depends, but I would say the country at this point. Um, tattoos or piercing? Piercing or tattoos? For me, tattoos. Uh, sea or mountain? Um, they're both great. Uh, I love the sea. All right. Thank you very much, Justin, for this interview. You were very patient.